peace of mind With the city so cold in the winter time In my mind, stuck in my mind It gets dark, it gets dark inside Trying to find some peace of mind With the city so cold in the winter time In my mind, stuck in my mind It gets dark all right what up what up what up it's your boy midnight man back at it again it's my first uh uh celtic spread you know this is actually a really traditional spread um and we will just pull this and see what comes out um right now just think of a question just think of a question in your mind and focus your energy on that you know try to visualize it and just really um ground your energy and focus on um that certain situation or question so we're gonna start out always with the celtic spread we always start out with you uh you in the terms of your question and that's usually this card right here i'm gonna turn this one over but i'm also gonna turn this over too well you know it was like this huh Ooh, the lovers upright. So that's attraction, relationship, connection, emotional choice to be made, relationship issues, commit or not, doubt, dilemma, temptation. I always look at um, the lovers is always. Um, I mean, it, it always does mean. It can always mean. Um, uh, a relationship, um, but I always looked at it as a cho as um, it's like a choice. You know what I mean? You always get a choice. Uh, also, connection, like it says, connection and emotion. So, right now, um, you might be in a situation where you have a choice, that, a choice that needs to be made. Um, you're in a dilemma. So, right now, you probably. Are in a situation where you need to um, look at what is right for yourself and judge uh, what needs to be done, you know, for yourself in a situation um, because there is a chance to have a, a really great um, relationship depending on what choice you pick. And then this one is the crossing card. So, some people call it challenges, some people call it crossing, um, you could say either or, it means basically the same thing, you know, uh, conflict or whatever, you know, that thing that's kind of just going up against, um, your situation right now, and it's Seven of Swords, so that means deceit or betrayal, strategy and evasion, a problem, cunning, thwarts, an enemy side, step the obstacle, so there's best, there's with this, with this choice, I, I, I feel like you're, you're, you're going through a situation where there's a lot of deceit and betrayal, you know. Um, if you, if you want to build upon your own life, you always have to um, release a betrayal or any type of negativity in your life, you know what I mean, in order to move forward. You know, if, 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 things, if things don't feel um, positive, uh, and you feel like there's so many native obst obstacles in what your where your life is at at this moment. Um, that usually, for me, it means that um, the situation you're in, you need to really look at it, look at the choices, and realize which one is the best one for yourself. Um, especially if you're in in a situation with deceit and betrayal, because that's definitely something you don't want to stay in. Um, the third card. Uh, this is foundation. You know, just like how the situation, you know, how the situation is. And we got six of swords. So I always look at the six of swords. You know, it says moving from turbulence to calm, long journey, travel over water, recovery from illness or near death, harmony restored with help. I always looked at um, six of swords, kind of like. Um, uh, going to calm, calmer waters, you know, or maybe uh, like like going away, you know, going away from 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 this betrayal, this 
this deceit, this situation where there's so many negative obstacles, you know, you got to go away from things like that and you got to, you got to move to where you have an opportunity to, to, to feel happy and have a positive outcome. You don't want to be surrounded by deceit and betrayal. Um, that's always a negative um, situation to be around. Um, and then uh, this one is the past. It's influence from the past. Oh. Okay. So the past, we got the emperor. So maybe... Maybe in the past, um, it seemed like everything was was stable. You had a nice foundation. Um, or the past could be that you thought logically about certain the this, this certain situation and. You were logical and you're, and you're you're trying to be traditional, traditional and very protective over your train of thought and the decisions that you made. Um, I always look at the emperor as just like a, well, sometimes it could be like exactly like controlling or whatever, self control or but I always look at it as being empowered, you know, and just um, being very assertive. Um, but I think in this situation. I've, I just have, I, I feel like it's more having a, sh uh, a strong foundation or like a stable foundation. Maybe that's what the past was for you. Um, let's look at the future. So, this is what most likely is going to happen in the future. We got two of wands, so achieving first stage of progression. Future planning success through strength and vision, and vision courage to overcome obstacles. So the future right now, even though you you're in a situation where you have a lot of deceit and you have a lot of betrayal or negativity around you, um, even though maybe you might be recovering from that situation. Um, you have to always take the first step, you know what I mean? Trust yourself, take the first step. Um, have strength. Because you overcome anything, you know? You just have to believe, believe, believe in yourself and move forward and understand that everything happens for a reason and to always believe in success because I believe in you too, you know? Next is the crown. This is the, the the desire of the situation that you have. Nine of Cups. Okay. So maybe I think having the strength to move forward, you might. You might want to move forward and declare either declare your love to this next person or maybe um, if this is an endeavor, maybe just being creative, you know what I mean? And having passion. Um, I always looked at the, the Knight of Cups as kind of like moving forward, you know, like, trying to, um, not seduce, but I mean, trying to, trying to, trying to, um, be a romantic person and, and stepping forward, you know, um, it also, you know, knights can also be, a, a younger person, you know, um, but I kind of look at it like you desire, you desire, you desire to move forward in your situation and if it involves love or another person um, 
you wish you wish to move forward and see what can happen. This is how you see yourself. Seven of Wands. Boundaries, defense, perseverance. Position, stand your ground, challenge, teacher, or public speaker. I don't know, I like, I always looked at Seven of Wands as kind of like being defensive, you know. Um, uh, what do you call it? Fighting against. To me, it's like, it's like, it's like you're back against the wall and like you're fighting up against uh, everybody and standing up for yourself, you know what I mean? Or any, anybody that's opposing you. It's kind of like you're being defensive, you know. I always looked at that. So maybe right now, um, you feel like you're you're defending yourself, and 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 how you how, how you feel and what you really want to do, you know, with the situation. I mean, it's tough because, man, if you had a, a positive past in a situation, and you're trying to move the calmer waters, planning. To move forward in your situation, I mean, you don't want to feel defensive and you don't want to be fighting off um, all these people. You can't live that way, you know what I mean? If that's your presence, if your situation, um, you definitely need to move to calm waters. At least that's how I feel. This is what's going on around you. Ooh, star card. That's great. That's great. I like that. So. It's basically having faith, you know what I mean? You gotta have faith, you know? Have faith. Believe, believe. See, healing calm after difficult phase. Follow your aspirations, optimism. You have to be optimistic. Have faith. The situation can only get better, you know? Positive changes. Don't always look at changes as negative. Changes can, are very positive, even though at first it's uncomfortable. Believe in yourself and heal. Healing after difficult situations. You know, if you're going through a difficult situation, um, it's important to stay optimistic and believe in yourself, you know? Like it says, have faith and hope. Believe that what you're doing is right and 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 you know you'll know if it's right because of how you feel about it you know if it feels good then you know then you know you're doing the right thing always follow your intuition you know his hopes and fears oh look at that ten of cups so you hope to have a beautiful beginning, to have everything. Completion, good fortune. You know, that's what I'm saying. See, if you if you believe and have faith, you know, you can have the Ten of Cups, you know? You can have the harmony. You can have the the happiness, the wish fulfillment, you know? It's just it's a matter of you believing in yourself and and, and having faith that you you will have your happiness. You 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 will have what you're looking for. You know, just keep keep moving forward. You don't want to stay in a situation where you're dealing with a lot of negativity. Okay, and the outcome always the last one. Eight of Pentacles. So talent turns into profession. Profession doing groundwork practice makes perfect quality craftsmanship. Uh. Attraction to detail, so I don't know when I look at this as an outcome. Um, I just think the outcome is you're gonna be you're gonna be you're gonna be working hard and I feel like you know with this with this outcome that you're you're gonna be in a better better position to do the things that you want to do. You know you're gonna have an opportunity to work hard on your future and to 
and to work hard on to the things that you want to do. Because I think, I think with with the Ten of Cups, um, your hopes, your hopes and dreams, what's gonna happen is, what's gonna happen is, you can have this, but you're gonna have to work for it. You know, the situation that you're going through, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna take work. You know, it's it's gonna take some dedication. It's gonna take, it's gonna take. Quality, craftsmanship, attraction, and detail. It's not going to be easy, and you're going to have to put you're you're going to have to put them to work and make changes. But you have to believe in your you have to believe in your hopes. You know what I mean? That you can get your your ten of cups, your happiness. You know, believe in that. Like I said, um, you got you got you got the opportunity. Like I said. You had an opportunity, a choice, to get to get your ten of cups. You know what I mean? You have the choice. You know, it's up to you. Even though even though you're you're surrounded by a lot of maybe a lot of people or a lot of burdens or just deceitful and betrayal energy. You just gotta realize that you don't wanna live a life full of deceit and betrayal. And you need to move forward. Recovery, recover from what you went through and move to calmer waters. And realize that the past is the past. You have to have self-control and the logic to move forward. And believe in the first stage of progression. Have strength and understand that it takes courage to keep moving forward even when you don't know what's going to happen. And then just believe in believe in believe in what you're doing and move forward, you know? Use your you use your strengths to keep going and believe in what you're doing. Cause you have an opportunity to get it. Get a cup. And you will get that cup. I believe in you. And even though you're going you being you're in a situation where you're where you're defending yourself a lot. Defending against negativity, defending against your beliefs, defending defending who you are as a person. Um, just realize that you're not by yourself. You're never by yourself. You gotta trust. Trust that through all adversity, you you will make it through because we have the star card. You gotta have hope and believe in yourself. Believe that you can get past this difficult situation and have optimism. Because your Ten of Cups can, you can get the Ten of Cups. Believe in it, believe in yourself, believe in what you're doing, you know. We all can have this. But the first thing is believing. Believe that you can have this. That's very important. Belief. Belief in the completion of this, 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 this situation and cycle. And know that it's 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 gonna take work. But you got the talent to do it. Believe in your talents, believe in yourself, have courage. Alright. All of you guys, I want you to have courage no matter what. If you no matter what situation you're going through, have courage. Believe in yourself, have hope, optimism. No matter what you're going through, you're always gonna see a brighter day. And when you're going through a night, you will see the dawn. This is it from your boy, my first Celtic spread from your boy Midnight. Peace. Welcome to the Midnight Zone. My uncle loves you and I love you too. I'm trying to find some peace of mind with the city so cold and all in a time. In my mind, stuck in my mind, it gets dark. 
It gets dark inside Trying to find some peace of mind But the city's so cold in the winter time In my mind, stuck in my mind It gets dark All right, y'all. Just gonna pull. Just gonna pull one card. There's no some lights here, though. So we'll just see what what comes out. You know. Usually, you know, we can do one that jumps out, but you know what? I'm just gonna cut this small marker. Oh, we're gonna cut this. Oh, that's the card. Oh, it's two cards. Wounded Warrior. Wounded Warrior, you've been fighting a long time. Don't worry. You're strong. I believe in you. We got Ten of Swords, but it's reversed. And honestly, I am not sure what the reverse is of that. Let's look. Let's look in the book because I'm not sure about that one. Let's see. Resisting the inevitable, not wanting to let go of negative emotions. Rock bottom, a narrative rooted in lack and helplessness. Devastating loss, recovery. Ooh, okay. So you're a wounded warrior, but you're very strong. You gotta believe in that. I believe in you. But you might be resisting the inevitable. Gotta let go of the negativity. Maybe you're in, not in a good place right now and you feel helpless, but believe in yourself. You know what I mean? I believe in you. I send you light and love, okay? No matter what you're going through. You're strong, you're powerful. Say that to yourself every single day. Nothing can stop you. Say that too in the mirror right before you Right before you go to bed and then right when you wake up. Peace out from your boy. This is my bonus.